Hey, what is going on? Wanted to rip down another robot. This one's the Roomba 614. This is an older model. And I wanted to compare the insides of this compared to the new i7. Since this is a cheaper robot, I wonder if they use different parts inside to save money. So let's start ripping this apart and we'll find out. First take that off, take out the rollers. Lots of hair up in there, nasty. Let's pop off the dustbin. Comes right off, nice and easy. Now I'm going to go ahead and take off these four screws which hold down the uh, battery and the rest of the robot. And the side brush. Alright, let's pop this off to expose the battery. And as you can see, compared to the i7, the battery is a lot bigger. Alright, this one's an 1800 milliamp hour battery. A lot bigger. I would assume this holds a charge a lot longer than the i7. So, just looking at it from under the body, it looks like it does use the same, same wheels. The same uh, spin brush motor. Yeah, so let's keep on going. I've not taken this one apart. I don't know exactly how everything comes out, but I would assume it's very similar to the i7. Alright, yeah, this one's held down by three screws, and I think the i7 was only two. There's the wheel, the spring, the motor. If I remember right, this doesn't feel as heavy. But it looks very similar. It's got the chip and everything. Let's pop these three screws in. Got the main screw. All right, slides right out. Once again, the little spin motor is separate.
Same exact thing. Now let's take up the extractor area, which appears to be four screws as well. Pops up. There's the motor for turning the rollers. I notice this one does not have that additional motor right here that the i7 had. Very similar take apart. See if this top panel pops right off. Yep. Nice and easy. Let's go ahead and try doing this without taking the bumper off. It's got a port here, so for when they can work on the machines. A lot of screws here. I'm just going to take apart all of them. Trying to get down on the motherboard. Right, it's looking like I'm going to have to take off this bumper. That's right, let's go ahead and do it real quick. trim piece comes off and now this just basically falls off all right so yeah you do have to take that off Turn piece. All right, there we have it. I could take this off, but that's just gonna expose more of the motherboard. Not really much under, nothing under there. All right, that's just a quick comparison of what an older, cheaper Roomba looks like inside compared to the new i7. If you didn't watch that video, check it out on my channel. I did that one as well. So, hope you enjoyed that. Do me a favor, like and subscribe please. And if you wanna see anything else on my channel that I could possibly tear down, just let me know. I wonder how much weight this can hold.
powerful. Error six. Move Roomba to a new location.